The IQ Logger tool can measure non-penetrative lineations on a planar surface. These lineations can be measured on either up or down hole facing planes and they do not have to pass through the centre of the core axis. If you are using the Index Hub system you need to set up your structure type list. There are two structure types. Planar structures are grouped as feature type plane and linear structures are grouped as feature type lineation. To measure a lineation you first have to measure the plane that that lineation lies on. It is often easier to remove the core from the tray to expose the plane and the lineation being measured. Note that your orientation line does not have to be on top of the core, it can be to one side. You just have to ensure that the IQ logger sits on the line facing down the hole when you zero or align the instrument. First you need to measure the plane the lineation lies on. Once I've measured the plane in the IQ logger app I select the name of the lineation I'm measuring, in this case a slick side on the surface of the plane. I then align the IQ logger with the lineation and make the measurement. Once we have finished taking our measurements we go to the verification screen and you will notice that the slick sides here have a gamma angle. This gamma angle is measured clockwise from the orientation line. The alpha and beta angles of the containing plane are also recorded along with the plunge and the plunge direction of the lineation in the dip and dip direction fields. You can also assign a movement direction for the lineation if known. So as you can see it's a very simple process to measure a lineation on a plane.